Welcome to Upgrade. I'm your host Frank the Tank, and today I bring I'm gonna bring a laptop stand, and this is our aluminum base laptop stand. Really strong. I mean, really flexible. And if you guys can see in the bottom, there's a couple of push buttons. We're gonna talk about them right now. But if you guys see the bottom, there's some rubber feet here, all right, to hold the whole unit in place when we move. Um, this is a quite little heavy, strong, strong, durable. Um, you got another rubber ends here for your laptop won't fall and then we're going to show you how how to set it up so there's a couple of ways you can do this so basically you put it down on a flat surface and of course they give you the instructions there too so there is a button here on the side of it if you guys can see it you push down the button all right and when you push down the button you just lift it up but don't let go of the button because if you let go of the button it stays fixed in certain clips so you can move it up all the way up and then what you do, there's another button here in the back end here on this part. And in this car case, you could just hold the button and it locks in in place. So here we have a side view, if you guys can see it. Uh, now, we're not done with it. They take it to another extraordinary extremes by pushing the button here. Look at that. Look at that. That's pretty much all the way up like that. And it locks in so because it's so strong and durable and it has um it's all aluminum base and it's really strong these things are hard to bring down they're kind of locked in if you guys can see it completely locked in and we're gonna put some heavy duty laptops in here to see how well they work and and not only that how they look so we're gonna start with the actual a couple laptops to go but if you guys could adjust it to however you want and of course this is gonna be facing you these two clips here, so the laptop won't fall, are going to be facing you. So we're going to go ahead and set a couple of laptops and see how well they work. And look at this. Flexible, breathable underneath. Plenty of space. So the air fans could come in, suck in all the air, blow it out. This is an Alienware machine I have on it right now. And if you guys can see, I'm going to turn it on the side so you guys can see a little bit more how the flexibility. So right now it's an eye level, but you could go higher. If you have one of those stand-up desks, this is perfect to um, level it up to your stand-up desk. And then the back, if you guys can see it, nice and durable underneath. Rubber ends are holding out. It does stick out a little bit, but it's enough base if you guys can see right underneath this is where the actual line the rubber ends this is actually made perfectly made for this kind of um um stand if you guys can notice and i'm going to keep spinning it so you can see the side of it um really flat you don't see anything thicker than what the laptop is it's a couple centimeters thicker if you guys can see it's like that much but look at no disturbance whatsoever on the laptop um weight wise i'm putting more weight i'm putting i'm trying to move it too much and you, you guys can see it it does move a little bit but it's strong it is strong and um it's holding on really well and this is an alien 17 if you guys can see the model on it um buttons press here and push there and if you want like i said you can even bring it higher as it is so let's go ahead and move along with another laptop so macbook here if you guys can see it this actually fits the color of the mac uh, I'm gonna twist it because it, it to see how thin it is. Look at this is a MacBook right here. Look at the bezel, how thin it is. Base wise, it's holding up pretty good all around it. You guys can see it all around it, and I'm gonna keep twisting it so you guys can see the back of it and how well secure this thing is strong. This is super strong. It won't go down at all. Um, so if you're worried about flexibility, look how strong it is. Push button here push button here and then you could raise it from the front this is like i said this is a raising part right here and this is a macbook so not bad let's continue on and do a surface surface book all right surface four and if you guys are worried about the rubber end it ends here and all you got to do is you can lift it from here in the middle like i said it's very simple you see that opens up and we're going to do a side angle of it stand really secure all around pretty much covers half of the it doesn't interfere with the air so you got pretty good airflow here in the back rubber ends um like i said height wise pretty good flexibility this is durable it won't move anywhere press a button um you get the height that you want so you can extend this like i said let's go ahead and extend it extending it hold the button here while you have the laptop on and we're gonna step back a little bit look at the extension of it so if you have a stand-up desk and it needs to be reached out to you this is perfect these are clip 
these are metal super strong metal aluminum base um, there's no any kind of oils in here so you don't have to worry about touching it here or getting some grease on your hand or anything like that it's pretty much good um, if you want to permanently drill these things down so you don't want it to move anywhere you can do that too two drill holes in there but pretty much this is a, a surface book and if you guys can see it and we're gonna bring it down so we will bring it down so you guys can see the side of you here bring it down slowly locking it in and that's it pretty much there's your book notebook your surface book for um, like I said look at this I'm lifting it and rubber base it won't move too much because the rubber bend see how the rubber ends are really really getting the actual laptop and the thinness of it bezel of it is really thin so that's pretty much does it i did three three laptops if you can see if you have any questions or any comments let me know i'm your host frank the tank and we're out